All right, all blindfolds are in place. Will you enter, Mystery Challenger, and sign in, please? One question at a time, in turn, moving clockwise. And we will begin with uh, Bennett Cerf. Well, that kind of tumult and screaming usually betokens glamour with a capital G. <laughs> Would you say you were a glamorous person? Well, I will answer that one with a thunderous yes. I didn't want to hear your answer. I wanted to hear... <laughs> Well, this would require perhaps a degree of immodesty which our guest would not like to display. So you'll have to take my yes and we'll try Miss Kilgallen. Uh, are you primarily a movie star? <laughs> I'm quite sure. <laughs> <laughs> and I will say yes to that to Mr. Borger. Does that mean you're not sure you are, or were you? <laughs> no, we were. Well, I planned to be. And the plans worked out. You're trying to be what? A movie star. You are trying to be a movie star. I sure am trying. You already get one question, Victor. You managed to squeeze well, two I and a half. Well, I haven't had it yet. Well, you've got two and a half. Here. I can't see my questions. I'm blindfolded. <laughs> <laughs> I have them all written down here. All right, Miss Francis. Are you at the present time in a motion picture appearing on Broadway, or are you about to open in one? No, ma'am. I'm not appearing, and I won't appear until about July. That's one down and I to go, Mr. Sir. Uh, beside your work in motion pictures, are you also famous as a financial directress? Yes. Miss <laughs> <laughs> Kilgallen? Hmm? What, what did... What, what was that? That was just my chair. I pushed it back suddenly. That was a yes. That was a yes. She, uh, well, did Bennett finish his sentence? Financial directress? Well, mm -hmm. yes. Well, my next question will get a loud no. Are there two of you there? No! That's two to go, Mr. Boyd. I can't tell when you're answering and when the guest is, John. Well, I meant to say no, but Mr. Daly just spoke up in front of me. He stood up. He always does. <laughs> I'm trying to guess who Jack, who Daly is. <laughs> <laughs> You're it, Victor. I'm what? You're it. I'm it. Yep. Um, I have a, a hunch. However, you say you are a directress, yes? Okay, well, that was asked. No, I didn't say I was a directress. Well, somebody did. <laughs> Mr. Bennett Serf said uh, he asked me, but I didn't say I was. Oh, I'm sorry. Was that a question? That was a question. No, that wasn't no. a question. You still have a question, Victor. Yes. yes. Yeah, I said yes to the financial well, uh, directors. Who's what here? <laughs> <laughs> That's all right. It's Tuesday. Are you in business outside the movie industry in which you are a director and in what? Well, I can't ask that. <laughs> Y'all are asking too many questions, and in the South, we only answer one. I'll answer the first one. Yes, sir, Mr. Boga. You, you yes. are, in other words, you are a directress in something outside the movie industry. Yes. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. That well, brings me no further. Miss Francis. <laughs> doesn't well, uh, I think Mr. Serve has it, and he was certainly right about glamour, and I believe he's right it's about twice as much for a nickel, too. Ah. And I think it is one of the really true motion picture stars, yeah, yeah. Joan Crawford. Isn't That's it? absolutely right. Yeah. Very nicely done. Now, 
Now you know why I couldn't be at Lord Jim party tonight. I? I was afraid that the last face you saw, you would consider <laughs> being on What's My Line. We noticed your absence. That's how, that's how we knew it, you see. I'm just sorry that I lost ten minutes of looking at you. <laughs> I'm a, I must say, Miss Jones has, has uh, many facets. Besides the uh, moving pictures and, and business, she uh, <coughs> serves with me in the U.S. So this is all by way of telling a story which I think <coughs> Miss Jones will be amused by, too. But it's really for Bennett <laughs> and for you all. And we had... Uh, Miss Jones serves on the USO board in New York with me, and we had our annual dinner this week for the gold medal award to uh, Roger Blau of United States Steel, and Bob Hope was there as a part of the program as a previous winner of the gold medal. And I was Toastmaster, and I thought I was doing fair, fairly well. And you remember this, John. Bob got up, and his turn came, and he said, uh, well, uh, it was nice to see John here, and he hasn't done so badly considering he hasn't got his interpreter with him, Bennett Sir. <laughs> And that finished me for the rest of the night. But we had a wonderful dinner. Thank you. And thanks so much for Thank being our so guest much. on What's My Line. A little early, but Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas.